whatever. No, you can, how about you start OnlyFans first and then if you make a lot of money, I'll sign up. What is up guys? Welcome back to another video. Another video reviewing OnlyFans. Also during this video, don't mind the scabs and whatever's going on in my nose. Apparently I'm going through some hormone changes. But the individual in question today who we're reviewing is Selena Powell. And well, you're in luck because I know there's going to be a lot of people watching this who have no idea who she is. I went ahead and did the Google search for you. What does Selena Powell do? She is famous for her beautiful Instagram photos and controversial allegations that relate to hip hop stars like Snoop Dogg, rap star Fetty Wap, Waka Flocka, Offset, and many others. <laughs> so what does Selena Powell do? Basically nothing. She contributes nothing to society. But somehow this girl has the audacity to have the most expensive subscription to OnlyFans I have ever seen. I paid a hefty fee in order to get this content that you guys are about to see. So make sure to show some love, smash the like button, and let's jump into it. So Selena Powell uploaded a YouTube video, which I wasn't even aware she had a YouTube channel. I joined OnlyFans, how much I truly make Q&A. Based on the title of that YouTube video, you already know it's going to be the most humble thing you've ever watched. Like, there's no chance they're just going to flex how much they're making. And then on top of that, in the description of that video, she has join her OnlyFans. And then also, if you want to start your own OnlyFans, join OnlyFans using this link. Which I thought was the most scummy thing because it's a referral link. It's OnlyFans.com forward slash her referral link. So what that means for those of you who have no idea what referral links are or anything like that, if you sign up for an OnlyFans and you use her referral link, that custom URL, she's going to get a portion of that money. So she's smart. IQ, I guess, greater than what I thought. Whatever. No, you can, how about you start OnlyFans first and then if you make a lot of money, I'll sign up. And he was like, okay, bet. Hey, bro, you gonna start an OnlyFans? Uh, I mean, I'm gonna wait for you to make one, and then based on how much you make, I'll make one. I bet. You were about to hear what the most intellectual conversations sound like. Good followers. He was, like, on it all day. Anyway, by the end of the night, we looked at it, and he had made $5,000 in one day. I was like, wow, sign me up. <laughs> Have you ever seen someone sell out so quick? $5,000 in one day. I was like, wow. Sign me up. I don't think I've ever witnessed someone sell out in a mere matter of seconds. This might be an actual world record. In fact, while we're at it, I will text the Guinness book. I'm going from his OnlyFans to my OnlyFans and wanting to see more of me. But I was comfortable with it because it's the same guy I was planning on being with for a long time. I was with him for like two weeks, whatever. <laughs> you were with him for two weeks? Two, two whole weeks. Whoo! That is a serious commitment. Planning on being with for a long time. I was with him for like two weeks, whatever. I was with him for like two weeks, whatever. Here, I'm over here imagining like a couple years, five years, 10 years is a long term commitment, but just a couple weeks, and you're already in the category of a long term relationship. $30,000 in one week. So he had saw that, and he was barely almost at 10. And I was telling him, like, baby, like, you're you're a man. Like, you need to have other other girls maybe promote you. Is this not the most strange flex you've ever seen in your life? I mean, props to her for being able to pull in $30,000 that quick. But the way she just casually flexed it, like, you don't even really have to put the amount of money you're making in a Q&A video. $30,000 in one week. But then to not only put how much you're making in the Q&A video to make the viewers feel like they're making absolute scraps and nothing, to then the guy you had that long-term commitment with <laughs> for two weeks, completely bash him for making 10,000. So he had saw that and he was barely almost at 10. Which is still an extremely solid number to pull. But also once again, just remember why she's relevant from that Google search. So guys, I paid $50. For those of you that are curious, for Selena Powell's OnlyFans subscription. So let's jump into the actual content. Now, upon subscribing to her OnlyFans, I got a direct message, which is mass sent to anyone that is following or subscribed to her on OnlyFans, where it's a picture, but this is the kicker. Look at the price of how much it is to unlock this photo. One hundred and fifty dollars a hundred fifty dollars to unlock a 
video that you don't even get a preview of. You don't know if it's just her taking a selfie or if it's her gardening or flowers or her out and about grocery shopping. You don't even know what you're gonna get for your $150. The caption said, hi daddy, here's a five minute video of me and sucking. Just let me know, but tips help me reply faster so I know you're serious daddy. So let me wrap my mind around this. On top of me already subscribing for $50 to your content, then immediately you request $150 for me to unlock a video. Then on top of that, we're at $200. Now you want me to tip so that you know I'm serious. $30,000 in one week. What the f***? This has to be a joke. There's no way. <laughs> There's no way this is legit. I mean, for instance, take a look at this one. It's captioned, who's up? I'm so horny. If you want the full video, tip me. So I'm going to describe with audio what it's looking like. Obviously with YouTube, I can't show you guys, unfortunately, other than the censored images, but it's her getting grand slammed uh, from a backwards position. Anyway, uh, what was more shocking than the video, the content is not even really anything exciting, was the caption, if you want the full video, tip me. So it's a little short snippet. But the full video, if you wanna pay for it, now, now hold your breath real quick. The last one was $150. If you want the full video of this one, $241. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. But I mean, if we jump back to her casual flex. $30,000 in one week. I mean, obviously there's people paying it. And I don't know what's wrong with these people. Maybe I need to offer counseling lessons, give some peer advice. And that's the reason I'm making this video. So you don't just slip into this, what I'm currently subscribed to. Here we have another photo. How's your quarantine been? Blank, me too. I should also state previous to my other reviewing OnlyFans videos, the scale of what you can do on there is immense. You can do basically nothing where you take selfies to all the way full blown you can really do anything you want. There doesn't seem to be any rules as far as I can tell. Selena Powell's falls on the extreme spectrum, I would say. It's full I mean, really, I guess to summarize this one, how's your quarantine been? She's just getting a good doggy treatment. I need new any offers. And which this one, based on the caption and the little snippet of the face I can put in, you already know she's performing a, a just a regular routine brushing of the teeth, but like a really aggressive brushing of the teeth. Along with her pictures and videos and requesting the most outrageous tips I've ever seen, she will post a uh, little community post saying 6 9 just gave me the clear to post our video. Who's up and wants to see it? I'm about to break the internet. So once again, this jumps back to the Google search of who is Selena Powell and what does she do? I think her community post basically describes it as well. I once got in a parking garage telling him bye, LOL. Who else likes public so this one is a video for those of you that are curious and Selena is, I guess, like taking a selfie while this dude is putting her on top of the car. I'm trying to think of the most PG ways I can say this. You guys all know what I want to say and what I would like to say and I would like to show you. But unfortunately, there's like certain guidelines and everything I need to follow. I already think it would be weird enough if I was just out and about doing my thing and I walk into a parking garage and I see just like two people having sex on top of a car, but it would take it to a whole nother level if I'm just out and about doing my thing and then I see two people having sex on top of a car, but on top of that, the girl has her phone out like she's taking selfies. I think that'd be the classic scenario where I'm just walking and it's immediate. Doing longer videos right now, but I just need as you guys have heard me state in my other OnlyFans videos, the captions are honestly what makes it worth it to me. And also, as I mentioned, if you guys are enjoying this content, please make sure to leave a like because this video is costing me a lot to make with everything I need to unlock and subscribe to. But anyways, the captions make it so much more worthwhile. Just seeing what these girls come up with and write and the cringe level and how awkward it makes me feel when I'm not even in person, just reading it through my screen, is a level of cringe I never thought I could actually achieve feeling. So for those of you that are curious, when she uploaded her YouTube video, I joined OnlyFans, how much I truly make. If you weren't already aware or you missed the point, the whole reason she even made that video, I'm sure not even a lot of people questioned it, 
is so she could promote her OnlyFans. Which, as I mentioned, I mean, I'll give her credit. I thought her IQ was around the 10 to 20 range, but I'll give her a 40 just based on her knowing to actually market. But I can't even hate. I mean, I'm envious. For someone whose category listed on Google as being famous for taking Instagram photos and being controversial, she's making a hell of a lot more money than me and probably majority of you watching. So, I mean, I, I can't hate too much. But I am still baffled and absolutely shocked how much Selena charges for just the entire everything. Now, what can you expect if you were to head over to Selena's OnlyFans and subscribe? Uh, a lot of people don't know whether they're going to see or if there's going to be anything worthwhile on there. If your sole purpose is to see her being then yeah, sure. If you're a fan of Selena for whatever reason, I didn't even really know who she was then yeah, subscribe. If your goal was to go to her OnlyFans and watch her go grocery shopping, then I mean, hey, it's probably not for you. And that's it for the video for today, guys. If you enjoyed it, please make sure to subscribe, especially if you're new to the channel. Make sure to turn on post notifications. And as I mentioned, please leave a like. Let me know what you think in the comments down below because I never thought I would ever pay a girl $50 to subscribe on OnlyFans along with unlocking content on top of that. And just remember, be careful. Ride or die, ride or die, ride or die. Now I gotta ride or die